Dragon Ball Advance Adventure. So, without further ado, I'm just gonna start now. Um, where do I go, though? Oh, Kami House. In order to train himself... Even further, Goku went to see Master Roshi. Krillin came afterward, and together, they were accepted as his people- Wait, what the hell? Krillin has eyes in this game. He has... I- He has the freaking white in his eye. What the heck? That's weird. I, I'm not used to this. It happily began going training. Goku began undergoing training from the world famous Master Roshi. All right, I will accept both of you as my pupils. Goku and oh, bruh. Hooray! Now then, let's get go to the place where you will train first. Okay, hold up. Hold up, okay. Okay, you are about to start your training. Old timer, hurry up and start teaching us. First, we'll have a rock hunting test. Oh, bro, they made this into a level. I kind of forgot about the training portion, so, I mean, that'll make for some interesting gameplay, I would think. Go find the rocks that I threw into the woods, and bring it back to me in the allotted time. I wonder which one of them will find the rock first. Oh yo, this is a whole ass level. Okay. Interesting. Well, I guess if you have to make a level out of any random part of the training portion, that would make the most sense, because... I mean, they're searching for a rock. So, like, whatever. I mean, it's a jungle. It looks cool. Why'd they make this? Why'd they make the freaking... Goku finds a rock part of the training portion, which took, like... I don't know. A little bit of an episode. And not, like, the, the freaking hyena desert. Into a level. Where Yamcha lived. I mean, I guess... Maybe it'd be better off because desert level, but, like... I don't... Ow! I don't know. It just seems weird that they didn't make the desert a whole level to me. Not that I care that much. But it's kind of funny. Save this. Wait, why am I not reaching? How do I get up there? I need, like, more jump. Bro, dude is fighting. Yeah, I know, right? The eyes. I mean. Okay, I know Krillin is actually supposed to have eyes sometimes, like he does in the new superhero movie, for example, but like, I don't know, the anime staff always drew him without the eyes, so it just looks kind of off to me. I feel like that's what Toriyama actually intended, though. Just, you couldn't see them, because, you know, they were colored, and they just didn't have an outline. Man, these wolves are kind of strong, actually. Or... I think they're wolves. Oh, yo! Health upgrade! Let's go! I like the little upgrades you can find sometimes. Now, so I don't know why, but the level design is reminding me of Kirby. Maybe it's because of all the little... Like, door areas you can find every so often. Like, I'm- I, when I'm playing Kirby, I just, like, running around and then- Oh, a door! And then you go out of the door. It's like Kirby without the flying and it's a beat-em-up now. Though, honestly, Kirby kind of gives me beat-em-up vibes, too, sometimes, with... The amount of moves you can pull off with the copy abilities. I don't know. I guess that's another example of a beat-em-up platformer, kind of. Oh, maybe? Oh, god damn it. I know a lot of... Yeah, true. It sounds like Kirby. That's true as well. Yeah, it sounds a lot like Amazing Mirror. In some areas.
Oh yeah, I forgot there was a timer. Okay, I better not freaking dawdle here. Oh yeah, I forgot I had the Kamehameha. Kamehameha! This game is really fun, though. I'll give it that. Bruh, these freaking pets, man. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Oh, I can do it in the air. Okay, that was pointless. Good to know. I didn't need to break any of those. Where's my rock? Where is the rock? I must find Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Oh gosh. Wait, Goku isn't wearing his turtle training G yet. This is this is preposterous. Where is his orange outfit? It's on the cover of the game. Or does he not get that till the tournament? I forget honestly. Maybe he's not wearing that yet. I think I'm misremembering that. Yeah, I don't think he gets the new clothes until the tournament itself. Dang, a closed door. Where are these freaking pterodactyls getting their bombs from anyway? I like how dinosaurs still inhabit the Earth in this world. It's funny to see. This is like humans just walking around and they're, it's like, oh crap, a dinosaur! The things I have to worry about in the Dragon Ball world, man. Like, like think of all the dinosaur attacks they have to deal with on a daily basis for like some random village. It's a very interesting world. Even in Z, there's dinosaurs, so, like, it's not like they went extinct. I feel like they wanted to drive home, like, the Goku wilderness angle, so they, they just had the dinosaurs in, like, the first saga, especially. I like that the turtle is like a super invincibility power up. Oh, it makes me stronger too. That's cool. Yo, dang. Dang, these random spears that are just here are annoying. Those are definitely gonna come back in the freaking general blue cave. Oh, you're right. It is getting low. Well, I better get a move on that. Wait, what the hell? Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster, 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 faster. I got a rock. I'm all good. Oh, wow, it even has a little symbol on it. Hey, Goku. Did you find the rock yet? <laughs> I win this contest. Even his regular moving sprite has the eyes. But that might be a fake. But it has the old timer's mark on it right here. Let me see a second. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Well, <laughs> I got the rock. You jerk. That's cheating. <laughs> The competitive world is harsh one. I love how much of a little... Wait, why is there a timer? Oh, well, I guess I have to rush the acrylic. Oh, okay, so... The daytime changed, and now I have to traverse the level backwards. 
so that's interesting. I don't know a lot of games that do that, but one of the games I know actually... Get this, another Kirby comparison. We got Kirby Star Allies. That's one example I can think of. And I imagine Mar Metroid does that sometimes too, because, you know, Death Timer and stuff. Can't think of a lot of platformers that have that though. Just gonna get that for a super power. Oh, what's this? Nice. I don't know what that is, but... I won't, I won't waste too much time this time. I already explored most of the level, so... That's gonna move at a good pace now. And get apples, because apples are nice. Pause menu? I don't know. What you mean, but... My controls are so good, though. Yo! It also gives them, like, super fast attacks, too. Like, freaking Smash Brothers no delay mode from, like, Project M or something. I don't know. Arctic M Turbo, that's what it was called. Ow. Definitely getting used to the combat. I'm moving at a brisk pace. Man, what's with these closed doors? I like to think that Master Roshi just kept all those there for his pupils to collect to use for their training. Yo, giant turkey! Dang it, I can't reach it though. Oh! Never mind! Wait a minute, all these rocks weren't here before. Okay, gotta be careful around here. Yo, his Kamehameha got stronger. Boom. Now I can one-shot them with it. Bruh. Oh, I see. I don't know. I don't think these items do anything. They're kind of just a thing. What a persistent guy he is. Hey, you want to fight for it? I'm not about to lose. Oh, crap. Krillin boss fight. Not what I was expecting. At least not right now. Bro, he's not even fighting back. I'm going to kick your ass, Krillin. Don't steal my freaking rock, you little... Yeah. No holding back. I'm not like a real Goku. I'm just gonna destroy you. Just gonna one shot Krillin. Wow, he's actually kinda strong. I commend your strength. However, I will kill you. Oh, man. 
boom. Got him. Area clear. Oh, are they gonna make the milk training a level too? I mean, that'd be a good level. Ho ho ho, you both have done very well. Old timer, never mind this stuff. Teach us some martial arts. What nerve you have to say that? I will train you in the martial arts. When you have gained the power to break ten of the large rocks here. Alright, I'll give it a try. Oh, minigame? Bruh. I mean, fair enough. This reminds me of those, like, Street Fighter Break the Car minigame thing in Street Fighter 2. And the Roshi's like, huh? How'd you do that? You no, know, Goku's combat in this game is a lot more pull focused than actual Goku. I noticed that. Not that that's a bad thing, just interesting. Yay, I did it! Old Timer. Now you'll, you know, I know Old Timer is generic, but he calls him that all the time in this game. Surely they can throw him a bone, right? Now you'll teach me martial arts, right? Uh, hmm, very well. Good grief, what kind of kid is this? Okay, I'll teach you a few techniques of the Kame Se- Yo, Kame Sen School. I mean, that's kind of his Japanese name. Oh, wait, he's, getting t he's actually teaching me things. Now, let me teach you a little bit about one-on-one -on -one fighting. Moving around is just like you've been doing up to now. You can move around by using the plus control pad and the A. The A. Yeah, other than the reach things, he doesn't really use it in fights a lot. You also push the B. <laughs> the B to attack. You can also try using them at the same time as the plus control pad. Now, try attacking Krillin and hitting him several times. Oh crap, more training. I like how it's like part fighting game, kind of. Part fighting game, part beat em up. Oh, that's it? Guard. Oh, you can guard? In one on one battles, you can guard against your opponent's attacks. When Krillin attacks, push back. Oh, okay, actually, okay, I guess these are new kind of fighting. That reminds me a lot of DBZA with the Krillin abuse here. Now, try guarding. Once you've done it three times, you're clear. Oh, okay, so this is just a fighting game. Interesting. Wait, Krillin's freaking icon has the no pupils. Or not people, though no white in his eyes. Beneath your H3 gauge is your rush gauge. While you have this gauge, you can counter an attack with the B. However, once your rush gauge is gone, you break. And that leaves you wide open, so be careful. You can only do damage to your opponent when they are breaking. Make sure you remember this well. The main point is to make your opponent lose their rush gauge faster than you. Well, maybe it's better to try it yourself, rather than have me tell you. Down, down. Down, down. Okay, so just beat the crap out of him. Oh, this is this controls different. This is actually feels like a fighting game. Like the jumping is different than in the regular stages. This really is part fighting game. I can't even do my pole attack. Yo, the Kamehameha is different, too. I did it! Launching attacks and pursuit attacks. Now you know about rushing and breaking, right? If you hit your opponent with a right BBB attack while they're breaking, 
You can launch your opponent up in the air. Once that happens, you can hit them with a... Wow, they even got combos. Pursuit attack. When that happens, time it right and attack with the B. Now, you try to land a pursuit attack. Do, 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 do. Oh, yo, that's... That's... Yo! Yo, this is sick. That was sick. Now, time for us to leap for the world tournament. Wait, what? Already? Damn, no no milk training? Okay. Damn. That's like the most iconic part of the whole training, though. Wait, we'll do our best. Okay, I guess they're already friends. I'm definitely going to be the winner. Hint. No. Thus, following Master Roshi's training, Goku and the others head to the world tournament. Oh, yo, he has the he has the he has the clothes now. At last, they have arrived at the world tournament. Winning his way through the preliminaries, Goku ends up entering the tournament. Hey, you guys! How was it? Can you enter? Uh-huh. You made it! Yeah, I trained a whole lot, after all. Outstanding! Well done! Heh heh heh. Okay, see you later. Now then! It's almost time for the matches to start. Honestly, my Roshi voice kind of sounds like Peppy Hair or something. Goku versus Giron. Contestant Goku! Goku, are you here? Goku, what are you doing? Ha ha ha! He's too afraid of me. Hmm? Wait, they're just skipping right the. Okay, actually, I mean, they're not gonna just make me switch the Krillin, I guess. I guess it's only Goku's fights, but like, imagine if I could play as Krillin and do his fight too. Like, that'd be fun. Yeah. Wait, what did he say? I missed what he said, damn it. You're, you're toying with me. Please begin the first match. I'm not asleep, I'm Goku, is what I would imagine he would say. Yo, this music's sick. Holy crap, he's, he, that sprite actually looks really good, too. Yo. Yo, he, he's kind of kicking my butt. I gotta be prepared here. Maybe I should do a launch. Yeah! That is cool. I'm breaking the rules. He's using his Kamehameha in the fight. I'm surprised he isn't using that freaking, like, bubblegum attack to, like, stunlock me or something. Nice. Hehehe. <laughs> A cinch. World Tournament second match. Goku versus Nam. I'm sorry? What did you do to Nam? Why are you white? Why is he white? Did they what the hell? They changed his they 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 whitewashed Nam. I'm I'm crying. What the hell? What is this? Goku, good luck. Oh, damn it. I didn't freaking read that on time. I, I took a screenshot, though, so I'll see what the screenshot says. What did they do to Nam? I'm sorry, this is just a travesty. People of the village, I will be sure to win and bring back water for you. Okay, that's what he said. Anyway, I don't know how I feel about that. That looks wrong. Right. 
Maybe his battle sprite will look different. Maybe it's just the lighting. I don't know, but it looks bad. I'm just, I'm just gonna say that. I cannot afford to lose here. Please begin the second match. Uh, a little bit better, but I don't know. He was darker in the anime. He was a little bit darker in the anime. But I guess that's fine. Also, Nam is cool. I like him a lot. He's, he's a cool guy. I like the wholesome story they had with him. Bro, these fights are just easy. Hello there! Uh, okay, middle finger. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Hey, hey, I win. You sure are strong. And bro, they're just flying through these. Yo, World Tournament Final Match. Goku versus Jackie Chun. I'm so excited to be able to fight such a strong man. I won't hold back against you. Same goes for me. Okay then, begin the final match! Okay, this is gonna be actually cool. Dun, 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 dun. Yo, that sprite looks so sick. Dun, 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 dun. Yo, even he has a voice. Dun, 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 dun. Oh god, he has so much health. Can I? Oh my god. Oh crap. The Invincible Old Master is kicking my butt right now. And he has a lot of stamina, too. I'm afraid. Jackie Chan, what the heck? I mean, not Jackie Chan. Jackie Chun, what the heck? <laughs> Boom. Okay, that was a good idea. Oh crap, he has after image. Oh crap. Oh yeah, I should block more. Oh crap. He was about to use Kamehameha. Oh, I'm gonna beat him. It made the fights actually pretty exciting. I thought it would just be the same as the regular gameplay, honestly. I didn't think they'd go all fighting game. Pretty cool. They went hard with this. And for a two-button fighter, it's not too bad either. Actually, it's pretty fun. Okay, I think I'll just delete this Cedar Fock person from existence. Hawkeye. Okay. Dragon Ball Super reference. You'll get it later in like 10 years, Cap. I did it! I did it! I won! Wait, what the hell? That didn't happen in the anime. He won? What? Okay. The canon has been altered. Finally, Goku is crowned. But wait, if Goku wins, that removes the whole point of the tournament. Are you kidding me? Like, Goku always knows something is stronger than him. That's like, the, po the whole point of the freaking tournament arc, bruh. Like, what the heck? What the heck, man? I mean, I know you have to have him win because video game, but like, have a cutscene or something. I don't know. And then, he departed once again to search for his Dragon Ball Memento. What? You're leaving so soon? You're a hasty one, aren't you? You're going off looking for them again? Uh-huh. I can train while I'm at it, too, so it's perfect. Okay, I'm off. Flying Nimbus. Yeah, as I thought, the tournament was short, but not as short as I thought. Okay, I'll see you all later. Bravo! Obtained collection item, Jackie's wig. Bruh. Now you can select Jackie for one-on-one... -on -one. Bro, they just called him Jackie. 
One on one fighting. Nobody calls him Jackie. True, well, they removed the monkey. Yep, yeah, okay, as I thought, straight to Muscle Tower. That's gonna be a whole level. But maybe not as much as I thought. I was thinking it'd be at least a good two levels. I mean, that was a kind of long portion of the anime. But maybe it'll be a long level. Ziki gets Grandpa's memento. Goku headed to the land of Muscle Tower. It was a terribly cold place. Goku had never known such cold. Snow saved him from being frozen. Wait, did they just call her Snow? Snow? Like her name is just Snow? Like Snow was a better name. Because this just makes me think the Snow literally saved him. Huh? Where am I? Ah, you're awake. This is Jingle Village. You are frozen solid. I know we don't see her for long, but she's cool. Wholesome. That's right, I was looking for the Dragon Ball. You're not from the Red Ribbon Army, are you? Huh? Who are they? Are they the bad guys? Yes, they are. In fact, according to Snow, the Red, the Red Ribbon Army was forcing to the villagers to work hard to find the Dragon Ball. What's worse, the mayor was being held inside Muscle Tower. Goku promised Snow that he would rescue the mayor and head it for Muscle Tower. <laughs> Honestly, I forgot there was a mayor. I just remember Goku just kicking a bunch of people's ass in the tower. Okay, I'm going to go take care of everyone now. Don't do anything reckless. Yo. We're gonna have... Yo, this song's cool. There's gonna be a sick Major Metallic on battle here. They're also known as Major Metallic in the manga. Yo, this music's good. Turning it up. Yo! Why is it orange though? Yeah, that is sick. I don't like how it's not blue. Just saying. I thought it was just because that was the weaker one, but no. It's still orange. Just giving me vibes of that one stair portion in Symphony of the Night. I hated it. Muscle Tower is just reminding me of Dracula's Castle for some reason. I have to kill that guy. I didn't know Red Ribbon had robots that looked like the peel-off ones, but apparently they do. Also, crazy. Yeah. I can sense it. Oh crap.
Wait, my beam attack. My Kamehameha did nothing. Yo, he looks sick. Easy. Oh, that makes sense. He's not dead yet, though, right? Oh, crap! Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, I'm guessing this tower is a lot bigger than it was in the manga. Slash anime. But, you know, gotta make it a level somehow. I was looking forward to this, though, because honestly, the muscle tower portion has, like, one of my favorite parts of the story. It's just cool. Like, Goku's just going through a big tower, kicking, like, a bunch of random funny bad guys' ass, and then, like, Android 8 is there, and it's cool. Hopefully they do him justice in this game. I love Aider. Oh god, there's dust in my room, so my eyes are like bothering me. I gotta go clean that later. I don't think I'll beat this before Splatoon 2, but it's all good. I mean, it comes out tomorrow. So I definitely could stream it, maybe? But I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll get to play it a little bit at least. Oh, rematch? Yo. Yeah, these are- oh wait, life water? Oh, I guess that's like the core and stuff. Roshi's glasses, Pearl Rock, Jackie's wig. They're just like little items Oh, bruh, already Major Murasaki? Or Sergeant Major Purple. As he's also- or uh, this guy's just gonna be a complete joke to fight, isn't he? I mean, he's not strong at all. In the anime. He kind of just does a bunch of stupid things for the most part and doesn't pose a threat until. Not until the part where he has his clones anyway. Otherwise, he's just a joke to go to. Really, the only one that put up much of a fight was freaking. Wait, because he cheated and, uh, Major Metallitron. Slash Metallic. No Shadow Clone Jutsu today, huh? Okay, never mind, I stand corrected. Couldn't have been that easy. Shadow Clone Jutsu! Okay, that didn't do as much damage. Holy crap, there's a lot of them. Okay. Boom. Hit three at once. Okay, this is actually crazy. I'm glad they delivered. Holy crap, they're actually beating me. Will Goku win? Find out on the next episode of Dragon Ball! No, he, that didn't happen. Not canon. Wait, they each have freaking individual health bars. Are you kidding? Okay, whatever. I'll kick their ass somehow. I'm gonna thrash your ass. I just gotta be careful around those ninjas. Stars. Slash hurricanes. 
Oh man, I am like basically dead. Man, this really is just a big level, as I thought, but... I mean, that does make it cool. It really does feel like a gauntlet of, like, stuff. Just like, you know, it does in the show. I wonder if they're gonna have that little maze. I mean, at least, like... Like, with Pilot's Castle, it didn't feel like it deserved to be that long, but, like, this part definitely is not overstaying its welcome, because it's actually, like... You know, showing a lot of the content that happened in the story, and not just, like, stretching a part that otherwise wouldn't be that long. It feels justified, for sure. By the way, Fig might want Oolong, so I'd recommend asking him about it, Capo. Just, just saying, throwing that out there for no reason in particular. Context is Mudai on Discord, by the way. For those who don't know, who are like, what is he talking about? Sad. But true. I mean, I could always give you some- one of my things that I might not want particularly much. I think I have Bora if you want him. I mean, he's kinda cool. I like him, but I wouldn't mind giving you him, too. And I'm pretty sure Pekko has an Oopa, but I don't really remember. Okay, that was shorter than I thought. Hey, you! Are you the boss here? Give the mayor back to me! I'm impressed you've gotten this far. I applaud you. I don't remember what he- I think he was like German or something actually, but I don't remember what he sounded like, so... You really are something else. I wish you were not an army. You think I would ever join you? Come on, surrender- wait, no Android 8? I'm crying. Um, I was saying that, um, I mean, I wouldn't mind giving you Bora if you wanted to have somebody. Because I know Bega doesn't have anything to give you, Freud, but... You're the one who's going to surrender. Huh? Oh, wait, I forgot about that part. Still no Aider, though. Oh, bro, this freaking guy. I'm going to watch you die. Okay, well... The Kamehameha won't work. Right? It didn't in the anime. No. Don't I have to break the wall open then? Like... Because there is no way to hurt him. If we're go going off of the logic in the show. Slash manga. 
Okay, this is gonna be a tough one. Oh, wait. Yeah, there's a wall right here. The cold is what kills him. I see. Cool how they integrated that into the fight. Oh, okay. I guess I have to keep breaking the wall open. I didn't see that wall, so, um, yeah. Help me, help me, yeah. I think I'll just camp him. Oh crap, he's beating me. Um... Okay, how do I dodge that? Am I dead? Holy crap, he's killing me! What do I do? Okay, wait. I have a plan. I think he's just gonna kill me. Oh, wait. Damn it. He's going to kill me. Oh, I dodged it. Come hi ha! Okay, I'm just gonna fight him responsibly. Holy crap. Damn. What do I do? How did I dodge? Oh wait, he has like a shoulder dodge thing. Okay. Nope. Damn it, how do I do that dodge roll thing? Okay, I did it. Bruh! Damn it. The spinning attack, yeah. Bruh! That's like impossible to dodge. Yeah! With a slither of health. Oh my god, he's dead. Alright, he's next! Okay, where's Eater to save the day? He's the one who killed him. Now, give me back the mayors, otherwise I'll send you flying. You've got a lot to do for a little kid. Go ahead and try to knock me flying if you can. Alright, here goes. Wait, are you kidding me? Not even a fight. Not even Aider. I'm crying. They didn't have Aider. How are you going to foreshadow the androids in the later part of the story? Like, are you kidding me? No androids? I'm crying. General Witch is defeated by Goku's attack, and Muscle Power also bases its head. The mayor is safely rescued and Goku also finds the two-star ball. Thank you. I didn't think you were really going to take care of them all. Hey, it was easy. Now I've got to go. Find the next Dragon Ball. Flying Nimbus! Oh yeah, Goku didn't lose Nimbus either. Good luck! Yeah, why didn't Goku just use Nimbus? I mean, he didn't lose it in this part of the story. Good luck! Do not turn the power off or remove the game pack. Eh, I think I'll just do the whole... Mm, should I do the rest? I mean... 
I guess I have almost hit an hour, but like this level might be like 10 minutes or something. Doesn't look like they have Penguin Village. I mean, even after this, there's still the general town portion. No, not, I mean, Mercenary Towel and a couple other things, and then, like, um, the Fortune Teller Baba Saga. So, I'll have finished half of the Red Ribbon Saga. So, I think it's fine. Shortly after leaving in search for the, to search for the next Dragon Ball, the Dragon Radar is broken, and Goku found himself unable to go on. He went to Bulma to have her fix it and the two of them went to an underwater cave. What kind of trouble was waiting for them when they got there? Wait, where's Krillin? Ah, hold on. Those guys are following us. That's the Red Ribbon Army. They sure are persistent. What are those guys coming after us for? Those guys always come and bother me. Oh, yeah. He's like, oh, yeah, by the way, the Red Ribbon Army is trying to kill me. <laughs> The cave is pretty complex, so be careful. Wait, what the... Oh, no. Bro, that Bulma sprite looks funny. Is this an export mi... Oh, wait, no. It's not an export mission. Good. Okay, she's just kind of just standing there. That's the funniest looking Bulma I've ever seen. Yo, the bats. They're cool. Wait, that just looks like Oolong. That's just Oolong's bat form, are you kidding me? Well, I guess it was a perfect replication then. Oh, this song again? Eh, it's fine, I guess. Hopefully this level doesn't last more than 15 minutes. Is that how long I predict it'll be like? Health! These health upgrades are doing me good, man. Oh crap, another true path thing. Don't eat the bat soup. Fair enough. Ah, I knew it! They re reuse those things here. I mean, they were a part of the story, in this case, so... Um, I guess I'll go this way first. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have gone this way. Okay, that's where I'm supposed to go, and I guess this way is the other path. I wish games were more clear on which way is the optional path and which way is the main path, because that's something I find troubling sometimes. Like, maybe I'll find a hidden good here, or maybe this I'll have to end up going back because I don't know which way was the, the, the optional one. I mean, both ways they go, so, like, I don't know. I don't think I'll be able to get back up from here, so I'll go back again. I'll just loop around. Skip the bats. It's still not very clear which way is not the thing. Just saying. In fact, I'm even more confused. At least I could go back from this path. Wow, they even got the little skeletons. 
Yeah, I'm guessing this is where you're supposed to progress. Okay, I'm gonna go back again. Yay for backtracking! It'll extend my time by at least a good couple minutes. Reminds me of simply the night. I'd be jumping around all the time, back and forth. Bruh, those spears just killed that guy. Honestly, this level design would fit right home in Symphony of the Night, somewhat. Well, I knew it, I can't go back now. Though, I guess I could just go back to the level later. Which I don't usually do, but I guess if the levels are going to be more open-ended, I don't have a choice. I mean, it's more replay value, it's a different path. No, I might tackle that path next time instead or something. I mean, I don't know. I wasn't planning on doing the cave, but the stream ended up a little shorter than I thought, and, you know, it makes sense to do half the Red Ribbon Saga, so, like, I don't know. To me, from log looking at how many levels there was after this, it made logical sense to do this part, too. I mean, the Muscle Tower wasn't as long as I thought it was, either, so... I feel like it's fine to do this level. I don't know if doing the hidden path is pushing it or not, though. Bats are annoying. Okay, the bat gave me a burger. You know, you know, something you would regularly see a bat have? A burger. Of course. Uh, is this another split? No, I just can't get up here. Unless I do that, then I guess I can. Oh, well, there was an extra life. I'd say it was worth it. Oh, damn it, I wanted that apple, but... I was busy breaking the wall. Nice. Just as play. What is with all these closed doors? Is there a way to open them or something? Eh? Okay, that was weird.
Alright, watch this. I'm guessing that's something we gotta do later, but I don't know. I think this is the part with the robot pirate. Right. Yo, Super Goku, let's go! Yeah, this is definitely the part with the robot pirate. I like this game. It really feels like you're exploring the end of the world of the enemy in a way. Cause it's cool. They adapted the arcs pretty well into beat 'em up form, I would say. I'm not gonna go that way. Actually, there might be a boss here. Okay, I was right, and he, wow, he looks sick. Okay, I guess I'll go that way. What is with the branching paths in this level? Yo, okay, okay, that was worth it. Good investment. seen all the anime. It is quite a treat, I would say. And the manga, of course. He's more like a mini boss, if anything. Guess they wanted to save it for the freaking General Blue, the real talent. General Blue. Oh my god, these guys are annoying. There. Those red ribbon robots.
There's a lot more enemies in these later levels. Not that that's a problem. They're easy to take care of usually. Oh, more cave? Okay. Oh, well, I guess there's a little bit more. That's a bottomless pit. Oh my god, the knockback! This is annoying. Whatever. A little bit of health ain't gonna kill anyone. Yo. Ho, ho, ho. Yo. Unfortunately for you, the Red Ribbon Army will be taking that treasure. I like how he's basically just James from Team Rocket, but both. Not you guys again. Don't you worry, it'll be over soon. I'll have to dispose of you, and find the Dragon Ball right away. You think I would hand it over to the likes of you guys? Oh, he just has a gun? That's lame. He should fight me hand to hand. Okay. Go oh crap, he's strong. Oh, he even does that. Yo, this is sick. Okay, he has a lot of health. I expected him to be strong, though. He did put up quite a bit of a fight to Goku in the manga, so... Oh, crap! That rock attack! Okay, I have to kick his ass now. I'm gonna kill you! Nice. Ah! The cave is starting to collapse! It's so- it's no use! We have to escape now, or we won't make it! Goku and Bulma somehow managed to escape the collapsing cave. Okay, but they they didn't they didn't have to leave the party anywhere. Goku puts a mouse in his mouth to save him. Ruined. Goku did find the Dragon Ball as they were escaping, but it was the three star ball. Ooh, that was a close one. You know they're mentioning, but it was the three star ball, but they they didn't really. Yeah, they didn't really mention that Goku's trying to get his grandpa's yet. This Dragon Ball isn't my grandpa's. What are you saying? Just be glad that we were we survived. Well, I'm going to go look for the next Dragon Ball. I've had enough. Don't ask me to help you out anymore. Bruh. Savage Bulma.
Oh, Corn Tower. Or Land of Corn, I guess. Okay, real quick, I think I'll just go back here real quick, since I could just skip through the level. And look for whatever... There might be a secret upgrade, I don't know. I'm, I'm just interested in what it is. Plus, I could just run past most of these enemies. Except for these parts where I have to fight them. Oh, you frick. Okay, this way. Let's see what this path will bring us. If it's nothing, I'm just gonna end up leaving, though. And maybe the game will throw in a bone and let me save it after leaving and not have me beat the whole level again. That's if I'm lucky, though. It's gonna be the most disappointing thing ever, isn't it? Wait. Isn't this just... You know, that part of the level I was... In before? Is this a new pathway? Because it looks kind of the same. Did they just give me the illusion of choice? Oh wait, this might be new actually, never mind. I don't know, I don't remember. I don't really remember, it kind of blends in, so... Yeah, I think this is new. Yeah, I'm gonna make a state, of course. That would make sense, because... Otherwise, I'd have wasted my time more. Okay, yeah, this is all new. Well, at least they threw me a boat and gave me a new level on top of the same level that they had me go to. Okay, I'm glad I went back, because, I mean, I do kind of like these little knickknacks. I mean, it's diamond. What did the other pack give me? I don't know, nothing, I guess. So maybe I should have took this path instead the whole time. Oh wait, this is where I was before now, isn't it? Wait, where am I? Yo! Where am I? Is this just like a giant maze now? Oh wait, this is where I started. Okay, I'm just gonna navigate around. Wait, no, I was just over here too, wasn't I? Oh no. I don't know. It's confusing. Bruh, they're just giving me free life. The bats are like health spawn enemies, like a Mega Man stuff or something.
HP fodder, I would say. Slash extra life farming if you really want it. But I don't care because I'm making safe safe, so. Oh, yeah, this is definitely the same level now. Oh well, I'll leave. Oh yeah, I should try to leave. Plain data for this area will not be safe. Okay, well, good thing they told me. I like it when games tell me information I need to know. We're already over here. I'm not, like, getting all the contents of the level, it's really fast. Bro, the game just lagged because of my epic coming on me off. I need help, so I'm gonna go and get that pickup. Basically, just a full health upgrade. Wait, he's going faster, too! Yo! Wait, does he just go fast at full health or something? You know, I was wondering that in my head, too. I was like, is Goku gonna get a speed upgrade? Because he goes kinda slow. Oh, it's only at full health. Are you kidding me? Lame. Should at least be when I'm like green health bar or something. There's a burger in one of these. It's kind of like Kirby. It takes a while when I'm playing the level the first time, but if I'm enough running through it, it doesn't take that long. Oh, yeah, other than this part, this part's annoying. Make sure to dust my room after I'm on. Oh, 
Maybe I should put General Blue and General White and Jackie Chug in the thumbnail. Okay, I don't have as much stamina as I usually would have in this fight, but I'm still gonna kick your butt. I think. Okay, maybe not. Damn, he has three health bars. We're getting into, like, Kingdom Hearts HP territory here. Well, at least his attacks are easy enough. Bruh, he just yeet at me. Have you considered shooting him in the fucking face? <laughs> Classic. <laughs> Miss Porter. Oh, I, I assure you, uh, the gorillas. I, I needed to shoot them. True, I am getting Clayton vibes from this for some reason now. Miss Porter. Imbeciles. It's been a while since I've watched Pat's videos. I should get back to that. I've been watching too much Scott the Was because I'm catching up on those, so. Uh. I got this. My quest for diamonds wasn't for nothing. Well, on the next episode, we are going to Land of Corin. So, um, yeah. If you like what you saw, feel free to follow and, like, um, check out my YouTube channel where I archive these streams. Ultra Mario 3K Archives. I got a lot of Mario Kart Tour, Sonic, Dragon Ball, this game right now, um, Toy Story 2, Castlevania, and more. So, yeah, feel free to keep watching. Anyway, have a, yourselves a good one, everybody, and take care. Have a good day.